What is up guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's Saray Karen and for today's video I'm going to be giving you guys an Apple update. Uh, I'm going to be giving you guys some information about a software feature that you probably didn't know about but that's why you guys have me. Anyway before we get to the video it is December 1st when I'm filming this so you guys Christmas is around the corner. Yes and for this Christmas I want to do a giveaway for you guys. Um, I really appreciate you guys. I wouldn't be this channel. We wouldn't be 4,000 almost 5,000 sub strong without all of you guys. So stick to the end of the video and I'm going to let you guys know what I'm going to be giving away and it might not be the first giveaway of the month, but let's get to the video. Alright guys, so back in September, Apple released iOS 14 and we all ate it up. We all loved it because finally we were able to customize our phones in ways that we never could before. But there was a big downside to that and I know firsthand, I made a video about making my iPhone screen aesthetic with iOS 14 back in September and something that you guys don't know because obviously you can't see the backside of me making these videos was that it took me about three to four hours just to customize my phone and then I filmed the video and then I edited it and all of that stuff but yeah it was a really long process and then it was just not as smooth or seamless of a process that everyone made it seem like you had to find the picture for the icon you also had to create the shortcut then when you opened up an application it took you to the shortcut then it took you to the actual application that you wanted to use and it was just it was too much so I dumped all of that moved my phone back to what it normally looks like with iOS 14 I took off all the customization because honestly as much as I'm on my phone I need things to be quick 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 so that was Intel this newest update with iOS 14.3 if you guys have the beta then you know that you can use this feature or if you don't know you're welcome but if you guys have iOS 14.3 and you guys have Malaco now we can get to customizing. If you guys don't know what Malaco is, it is a really cool app that allows you to download themes for your iPhone instead of going through the websites, finding pictures, uploading the shortcut. No, 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 no. With iOS 14.3, you guys do not have to do that anymore. All you have to do is scroll through Malaco and download whatever theme that you like. The themes are really cool. You have aesthetic ones, you have fun ones, you have weird, colorful ones, uh, you have really minimal one something that I went with and I really like it because it doesn't take you through the shortcut feature that you had to do when iOS 14 first dropped and that is what I really like so I went back and customized my phone with Malaco and I saved you guys the time because I want you guys to know that this app is safe it does make you download a profile for your main dedicated Apple apps and then your third-party apps like Twitter Instagram reddit um, you do download those two packs but it's perfectly safe for you guys to download and it's something that I have been using that's why I'm coming to you guys with this video but yeah Malaco is really really nice it provides everything that you need and everything that you will want with the theme and it is seamless so if you guys don't already have iOS 14.3 you're going to want to go to Apple's website download that on your phone and then you can go and install your Malaco profiles onto your phone and voila you're done no crazy things that you have to do no looking for pictures on the internet none of that stuff it's pretty much plug and play or download and go right so that is it for this video you guys I wanted to bring you guys this little bit of information because I haven't seen too many videos on it I know I update made a video about it but I feel like it's one of those little subtle things that Apple slips in there that not a lot of people know about so of course if you guys like customizing your things we all do making things personal to yourself Malaco is the way to go and it is definitely a safe app I really like it so far um, the only downside to this whole thing is that you do have to have iOS 14.3 but it is something that you can download because you can just go to Apple's website and get that beta now you guys to the giveaway you guys if you've been paying attention in this video you ha would have seen that I snuck a little Easter egg in it but you guys I am going to be giving away a HomePod Mini. That is right, you guys. I just made a video for this uh, last week in an unboxing of my HomePod Mini, and I have been in love with it. So in love. This is the first thing that I'm gonna be giving away to you guys to show appreciation because let's get in the Christmas spirit. If you guys don't celebrate Christmas, let's get in the holiday spirit of giving. So I'm going to be giving you guys 
a HomePod Mini. The sound is amazing. The price point is amazing. The 360, uh, the 360 sound is amazing. I already said that. But yeah, you guys, um, all you have to do is be following me on Twitter. You have to obviously be subscribed and you have to share this video. So I know a lot of you guys are going to say, sorry, I don't have a Twitter. Well, there will be more giveaways, but this one is specifically for people that follow me on Twitter. And don't forget to be subscribed to the channel. Obviously, that's super important. And share this video and that is it you guys um i guess i'll give this video until my next upload to choose a winner and then you'll just email me i will send the home pod out to you and that's it uh i hope you guys enjoyed this video this is a fun little apple update i haven't did one of these in a long time and i thought malaco was an app that you guys would definitely get some use out of um customizing your phone is fun adding things to your phone is fun so yeah i will see you guys in the next one peace